this lecture we will study regulation of kidney functions the functioning of the kidneys is efficiently monitored and regulated by hormonal feedback mechanisms feedback mechanism means it is a mechanism to regulate the timing and precise release of hormones in case of regulation of kidney functions hypothalamus juxtaglomerular apparatus adrenal gland and heart these are the key players involved in the regulation of kidney functions before analyzing the regulation process let's see what are the functions performed by kidney functions of kidney urine formation and osmoregulation osmoregulation means it's a mechanism to regulate the body fluid volume and concentration of ions for this in our body we have osmoreceptors these osmoreceptors can detect any change in the volume of body fluids blood volume and the concentration of ions now let's discuss the mechanism to regulate kidney functions an excessive loss of fluid from the body activate these osmoreceptors these osmoreceptors stimulate the hypothalamus to release adh from neurohypophysis adh means anti diuretic hormone this hormone also known as vasopressin and it is produced by hypothalamus and it is stored in the posterior lobe of pituitary that's known as neurohypophysis from where it is released this adh facilitate the reabsorption of water from the distal convoluted tubule of kidneys so the filtrate become concentrated and the urine formed will be hypertonic an increase in body fluid volume switch off the receptors so the entire loop here is completed osmoreceptors detect the change in the body fluid volume now it is regulated now the body fluid regain its balance adh can also affect the kidney function by its constrictory effect on blood vessels constrictory effect means is it can constrict the blood vessel so the diameter will decrease blood pressure increases due to increase in blood pre- blood pressure glomerular blood flow increases which leads to the increase in the glomerular filtration rate so blood pressure increases glomerular filtration rate so the urine formed will be high role of juxtaglomerular apparatus or it is also associated with ras renin angiotensin aldosterone system or we can simply call it as a renin angiotensin mechanism the juxtaglomerular apparatus plays a complex regulatory role how it works let's see a fall in glomerular blood flow glomerular blood pressure glomerular filtration rate activate the cells that are present in juxtaglomerular apparatus which release a hormone known as renin this renin convert angiotensinogen that's present in the blood to angiotensin 1 which is further converted into angiotensin 2 angiotensin 2 is a powerful vasoconstrictor so the blood pressure increases glomerular blood flow increases glomerular filtration rate also increases so which ultimately leads to the increase in glomerular filtration rate Angiotensin 2 activate the adrenal cortex to release aldosterone. Aldosterone also causes the reabsorption of sodium and water from distal part of the tubule which leads to the increase in blood pressure. So if blood pressure is high, glomerular blood flow will be high. Glomerular blood flow means flow of blood towards the glomerular parts of the nephron where the filtration takes place in high pressure. so the glomerular filtration rate will increase so here aldosterone and adh hormone have the same effect 
we can also known as they have synergistic effect synergistic effect means same effect both increases the glomerular filtration rate role of heart an increase in blood flow towards the heart release a hormone known as atrial natriuretic factor so this atrial natriuretic factor can cause vasodilation so the blood pressure here is decreases it act as a check against renin angiotensin mechanism in renin angiotensin mechanism glomerular filtration rate increases blood pressure increases or glomerular blood flow increases but in case of uh, atrial natriuretic factor it oppose the action of uh, this um, aldosterone adh so here the glomerular filtration rate or the blood pressure can be maintained so due to the antagonistic action of atrial natriuretic factor and renin angiotensin mechanism regulation of kidney function takes place if you like this video like share and subscribe thanks for watching have a nice day